How do you do, ladies and gentlemen, and men and women, and boys and girls, and people, and my friends everywhere? I am Professor Julius Sumner Miller, and physics is my business. And our physics today, our business today, will be most astonishing for you, and you will not believe it. But that's the kind of stuff that emerges from this mysterious place. Consider the following. But first, by way of introduction, while I'm talking some stuff on the blackboard and uh, about then to do the adventure for real, recall what it is you encounter when you blow up a balloon. Now the story goes as follows. I am going to have a tea tube with flexible connections. Let's take a look at it right here. Here it is, a T-tube with flexible connections. And the ends come down like this. And there is a little funnel or a little thistle tube on the end of each T. And then there is a rubber tube here. Now what am I going to do? I am going to dip each little funnel or thistle tube into a soap solution and blow some bubbles. So right away you've got the idea what has happened to a, an old man in his later years engaged in blowing bubbles. I could blow two bubbles which are the same size by blowing air in here. See, like so. But if I blew two bubbles the same size there'd be no problem. And my life is devoted to posing problems. So I'm going to blow one bubble which is small and another bubble which is big. Notice S for small and B for big because I can pinch this tube here and blow more air into there. Now having blown the two bubbles, one small and one big, by putting my mouth here and blowing air in, I'm going to shut this off by pinching it like this pinching it tightly, closing it off, and the two bubbles are then connected with each other, but not with the outside air. And we ask, what do you predict? What do you predict? And aren't you already convinced that there's only one thing that could happen, and that is they will get equal. That is a reasonable view. More air in here, we'll push some in here, and they'll get equal. But that is not right. And it being not right fits this strange place, my castle of operations. Watch it. Watch it now. Be very cautious. Small one. Now we'll just wait. I have shut off. Watch. I'm afraid that I made the small one a little too big, so its action is a little slow, but we'll take care of that. Let me just break it and blow a smaller one. There. Watch now. Watch. If you are closely watching, you see that the small bubble is getting smaller. And the smaller it gets, the faster it gets smaller. Watch it. This is an absolutely unbelievable thing. And I shall say more about it next time when I hope to see you again.